this weekend, Chelsea, a chance to move eight points clear of them. How significant do you think that would be for Tottenham? Well, I think it's always a massive game because it's a London derby. And always the rivality in between <clears throat> Chelsea Tottenham is there and of course will be a massive game for both teams. Is there more pressure on Chelsea because they're so far behind? No, I think uh, when you play this type of, of game, um, I think the pressure is for both teams. And uh, of course, uh, um, still a lot of game to play. I think it's not a final, it's not a decisive game uh, that is going to put you in one or another position because it's still a lot of game to play, but uh, but always it's important for your confidence, uh, your motivation. Uh, to win uh, on Chelsea will be fantastic for, for everyone, but sure that will be a very tough game. They are uh, a very good team, uh, great quality, and always it's, uh, it's tough to, to compete with them. I think to compare with uh, Arsenal, I think it's, it's similar, similar um, uh, in every scene because uh, I think um, Arsenal or Chelsea uh, or West Ham is is a, it's always a tough game because um, our derby. And um, yes, um, for me it's a similar, similar uh, uh, type of of uh, opponent, and and of course uh, for the fans it's so important. Um, but of course for us because three points for us will be fantastic to put us in a very good position on the table. The last time Tottenham beat Chelsea at, at Stamford Bridge, I think you could get a pint of milk for 30p. Uh, it was February 1990. Uh, do, is, does that stat or will that stat feature much in, in your pre-match talk with the players? No, I think it's not a, <clears throat> a point to be to be focused for us. Um, we are focused, and we must be focused. Uh, must uh, focus in in win and in performance. Performance and to have the possibility to to be better than them and and, and have the capacity to to win the game. Um, I think it's of course the history is the history and is there, but it's not going to help. First of all, Chelsea and, and then us. I think that is no count in the on the game. Yes, um, I was in New Orleans, Boy, yes. Yes, my debut was in 1989. Yes, my second season was 1990. Yes, I remember, I remember. I was so young, 17, 18 year old. And uh, yes, a, long, a long, long, long time ago, long time ago. Did you follow English football back then? Did you, were you aware of uh, Tottenham and Chelsea? And did you follow the English football? Uh, to be honest, difficult. Uh, in Argentina, it's not that moment or that period that uh, with the internet now you can see everything. And in that period, it was so difficult. No internet, uh, not too much uh, channels, TV channels. Um, maybe you sometimes hear from the radio, and, but sound very very distant, no? and, but I think, uh, um, yes, um, I was in a, in a different world, different world, completely different world in 1919. Gareth Southgate has said that Harry Kane will be back sooner rather than later. Has he got any chance of playing this weekend? We need to assess him. Uh, he is very positive and he's doing very well. Uh, every day is improving. Um, we need to assess still a few days to to the game. Um, I think it's it's difficult now to say yes or not or to be involved or not on the on the game. Yeah, but surely that's a positive that you can't. You're saying that's not a firm no that he won't be involved in the game. Is that a positive? That he's, he's, uh, I cannot say no, but I cannot say yes. <coughs> yes, uh, it is not. Uh, the weekend is in maybe next, next weekend, but 
the most important that we are so positive so positive about uh, his recovery and he's doing fantastic and we are so happy because um, after Bournemouth uh, everyone believed that maybe will be long uh, um, period out but um, I think the evolution was fantastic. Another one of his club and international teammates, Deli Ali, uh, Gareth Southgate, <coughs> talking about him this week. He said he was a certain starter uh, at the World Cup. What's your advice to, to Deli Ali here? You've been hearing that from Gareth Southgate. Have you got some advice for him as a club manager? To Deli? Well, with Dele always, I, uh, my relationship is, is very good, uh, like all the players uh, here in Tottenham, of course. Um, always, um, not only advice, is talk, is to try to help the players, um, push the player when they need to be pushed. Um, and I think, um, of course, um, I think my, my job is, is to try to help, to help the player uh, to achieve what they they deserve or they want, and bring or give the the, the better tool to to performance. That is a, a, one of the my shops. What did you make of, of Southgate's words? Will that help get a reaction from? I don't know. I cannot uh, give uh, opinion about a context that I wasn't there. Um, the national team have uh, they contact. The context and Tottenham, we have different contexts. And I wasn't there. I don't know. I don't know. But, um, and cannot. Uh, only I can talk for myself. Uh, what we are doing here, uh, how is uh, him in Tottenham, and um, on the end, try to help him to to achieve the thing that uh, he won. How is he fitness wise? I know Southgate said he wasn't finishing all the training sessions. Is he okay? I don't know because I wasn't. I wasn't in the training session of the national team. Um, for us, uh, the last two days, uh, he was very good. He was fresh. He was. Uh, he was uh, fit, and uh, I am happy in the way that he uh, he showed uh, his uh, in, in his in his fitness, and I think. Um, it's a normal normal day training with the rest of the group. Like uh, always, um, it's, it's a squad that we need to decide. The, the first of all, the starting eleven, and then the player that are going to be on the bench. Uh, we are lucky that uh, nearly all the players fit, and then it's about about balance, no. No, I don't talk about rumors. You know better than, than me that I'm never going to explain nothing. Uh, just a final question on the, the Anthony Joshua fight is Saturday night, obviously the match on, on Sunday. Would you have any problems with your players staying up slightly late later to watch that fight on Saturday night before the game? You know, I cannot, uh, we, we are not police uh, to control them in the on the rooms because sure that we are going to to be on the hotel waiting for the game um, but we cannot uh, put cameras and see what they are doing they are professional and sure they are going to to sleep because um, the combat they can record and then see the day after no and the game that we need to play sunday you need to be fresh and with uh, uh, all the energy to try to, to win. Right. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Was there a lot of talk about the 2020 Chelsea manager future since the beginning of the season? Do you think the lack of stability has affected any uh, manager uh, like uh, performance during the season? <coughs> he won the, the, the league last season, but this season is not doing it that well, like the last one? L like uh, before. Um, I am not there to see what happened, is affect or no affect. Uh, I have a lot of problems here to fix and <laughs> to deal with a lot of problems. And uh, it's, it's, it's so difficult to see what happened in, in different environments, different contexts. And um, only 
I hear only you listen sometimes and comment, uh, but uh, on the reality, I cannot give a, a real opinion because I don't know. I don't know how can affect or affect or not affect. It's, it's, it's impossible to, 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 to have uh, an opinion about what happened in, in different clubs. How important is the stability of the manager position in general during the season? How important is that for the manager? Yeah, but I cannot talk, uh, I cannot talk about general, uh, general things that happen in football. I think uh, I need to put everything in context. If you ask me, is this important for me in Tottenham, here, in this context? I think for me it's important to have good relationship, uh, stability and discipline and everything that I think everyone uh, like or find, try to find in, in different clubs. Um, yes, for me it's important.